you're looking at two solutions with universal indicator added. The yellow color tells me these solutions are at a pH of 6, which is slightly acidic. Let's add a tablet of Alka-Seltzer to this solution on the left. The initial red color we see tells us that the solution has changed to strongly acidic, but you'll notice it relaxes back to a yellow color, indicating a pH of 6 again. Let's add some acid to both solutions to see what happens. When I add acid to the Alka-Seltzer solution, there's nothing going on. But wow, look at the red color when I add acid to the other solution. That's a huge color change. Now I'm going to try adding some base to both solutions. Once again, I don't see any color change when I add it to the Alka-Seltzer solution. But hey, do you notice that? I'm seeing color changes when I add it to the solution on the right. And that blue color tells me that the solution is now strongly basic. I wonder what's going on here. The answer is that the Alka-Seltzer solution contains a buffer or a solution that resists changes in pH. 